hey y'all hey this is christina aka chrissy welcome back to my channel happy valentine's day even though it's early by the time this video is going up a couple days early um but if you're with someone you love every day it's valentine's day yeah i know cliche but anyway if you want to see how i got this look then stay tuned Okay, to get started, my brows are already done, and I did my base using um, LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Toffee. And the first color I'm using is Coastal Scents Oktoberfest. Oh, name first. And I have pan. Listen, if y'all don't know about the OG Coastal Scents Oktoberfest, it is a black girl's best friend. I swear. Since this is a Valentine's Day look, I thought it was only right if I used the Too Faced Love Palette. It's kind of blinding, but cheesy, maybe. But you know what? I'm doing it, okay? Here's what the palette looked like. You're gonna take this shade, which is Dearest, which is like a true yellow gold. I probably should have Use the base to control this uh, shimmer shade. About to have glitter all over my body. Okay, so I didn't take um the gold shadow all the way out to the end of my eyelid because I want to put a matte shade in there, deepen up the crease. Uh, only thing about the love, Too Faced Love Palette, doesn't have a lot of mattes. I think it's all like maybe one or two. Um, yeah, it's not many matte shades. So, have to go another palette or get another shadow. So I'm going to go with um, the Too Faced Totally Cute Palette. And use the shade um, Chocolate Donut, which is that brown right there. Oh, that is deep. It's deeper than it looks in the pan. I use another um Yeah, that's uh, a little deeper than I wanted. Oh, that's deeper than I wanted it. Um try to soften if I can the edge. So I'm gonna take uh Oktoberfest again. And uh, see if I can tone that down a little bit, at least around the edges. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to take Coastal Scents uh, Chocolate Tear and go over the previous uh, Too Faced Shade top Chocolate Donuts. So taking Coastal Scents Chocolate Tear and going over. Too Faced Chocolate Donut. So I'm gonna put some more Dearest on, which is the gold shadow I put on. It's gonna wet the brush I used this time though. Um, oh, sorry. Oh, that was a uh, setting spray I used. 
Uh. Ooh. Look at that. Shouldn't have wet it the first time. That just took it to a how never level. <laughs> Y'all know where that's from. If you don't, Mad TV. Gonna color correct. Orange correct. If you don't know, corrector is used to cancel out um, other colors or hyperpigmentation. So, an orange color would cancel out dark circles. Uh, I believe there's a yellow, pink, green correctors. Green will cancel out red if you have a blemish. <sighs> so along with this look, I'm gonna be trying a new foundation because Chrissy Confession. The last one I did was what which the last video I did, which was the anti Valentine's Day video, um, I noticed after the fact that once I was editing, that the foundation or the powder, which or a combination of both, made me look ashy. So I tried, picked up a darker foundation. I'm gonna see how this goes. And I picked up Maybelline Fit Me um, Matte Poreless in the shade 356 Warm Coconut. All right, so I'm just gonna pour the foundation on the back of my hand. Ooh. Where's the top? Oh, oh, help me please. It's running. Uh, um, I hope this is a better match because because uh, Okay, so I put another layer of the concealer on because I felt like kind of light. Uh, gonna say Oktoberfest, and um, to my under or bottom lid. That, I feel like I did too much on the, I mean, I could if I was going for a look, like smoke it out, but I just want a little color. I don't want, I don't want a lot. I don't want to like, overdo it. I'm going to say Inglot gel liner and uh, line my lid lightly, nothing major. I forgot, I was supposed to set my concealer right after. And if you do that, you just want to make sure that uh, it's blended, especially under the eyes before you set it. Makeup Revolution uh, Baking Powder. And um, terracotta to set under my eye. 
And the other places that I highlighted. And even though it's baking powder, I don't bake like that. Big Mac, not Mac. Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless uh, Face Powder and 355 Coconut. Set the rest of my face. Ooh. And for blush, I'm gonna use Milani Bella Rose Baked Powder. I am not. Am I I'm not following my normal routine for the most part? Well, some parts, but it's okay. The L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black. All right, for the glow, I'm going to use Anastasia Beverly Hills, um, well, it's the gold glow kit, um, I can't fully show you it. There's one broken, and I haven't fixed it yet, so, yeah, but I'm using Golden Dawn from, um, the palette. Get some of this cake. <laughs> I got a little too excited. Can you glow too much? Can't, right? Shine bright like a diamond. Shout out to Ruby. That's a that's the end of a life. I don't I don't care. It is. Cause who don't wanna shine bright? Literally or figuratively. Alright. Uh, uh. Gotta do my inner corner. I think I'll take Golden Dawn. Use that for my inner corner too. Because why not? I'm right, gonna do my lashes off camera because it's struggle city. And well, such is life. Alright, I'm back. Um, lashes on. Just gonna use a black liner. A good liner to line it and go over the band, the lash band. Nothing no major. Oh, okay. Now, me doing my lashes is low-key struggle city, so. I'm sure nobody wants to go through that, so until I'm um, comfortable and <laughs> secure, is what it is. Now, for the lips, it's only right that um, I do a red. Because love is love. Um, using Colored Rain Cherry Blossom. 
matte lip. This has become my favorite. If y'all know anything about MAC Ruby Woo, which is still one of the top goat reds. But Cherry Blossom by Colored Rain. Love it. And um, fun fact. It is black on black on, so shout out to them. Oh, it's this CoverGirl um, Outlast Active Setting Spray. Cooling Setting Miss All Day Wear. Um, <clears throat> it smells like cucumber. Like cucumber, melon, or something. It's not bad, but when I first sprayed it, I was like, oh, this is different. And I was like, well, this is the finished look. While I was getting ready to do my next video, I realized I didn't do an outro. So... This will be an intro slash preview to my next video. You wanna sex little dress. Um, so if you wanna know where I got this dress, then tune into my next video, which is a plus size haul. And thank you for watching. See you later.